The other thing I want to point out is that uh, there's a much higher <clears throat> failure rate with folks that have these vocal dogs. Because <coughs> the assumption is that if they're vocal, that that means you're too high or that they are in pain. And it's possible that it is really uncomfortable. Um, but that's not what determines whether or not your level is right. What changes the behavior is what determines if your level is right. So if you have a dog that tends to be dramatic um, because they're aroused, they're stimulated, they're anxious, um, and they tend to be vocal, people have the tendency to use a level that's too low. Um, right, so you can't go by the reaction you see in the moment. You have to go by the future behavior that you see following the correction. It's like, was it effective? Was it not effective? Right? The next time I come outside this afternoon, do I have to do that same thing again and again? Right? Or do I see an actual change in her behavior that sticks?